of all these, right or left, R or S, um, this carbon has two chiral centers, two places, two carbons that are chiral, and this one does. Fantastic. So uh, we're going to name them R and S, and then in, in the end, I'm going to ask you if these are actually both chiral. Okay, so do they have a non-superimposable mirror image? So if you want to work ahead, feel free. Uh, otherwise, you can go at my pace. So, uh, starting with the first one, let me draw it a, a lot bigger. So we have space here. CH3, H, CH3, H. Okay, now let's number this dumb thing. We've got the top four. And just like before, now we've got a carbon, a carbon, and a carbon. So those all tie. So you go to the next point of difference. Well, this carbon has all H's, but these carbons have other carbons. This has got to be three. Now these carbons with other carbons, this one uh, has two H's on it, but this one on the lower right only has one H on it. Uh, it has another carbon. So this is the highest priority, and this is the second highest priority. Okay? You need to explain that again? Yeah. One more time? Sure. So four is obviously the lowest. Uh, this carbon, so they're all carbons, all the other three. This one has three H's. This one has two H's. And this one has one H. Well, the one that has three H's, that's the lowest priority uh, of the three, because the three hydrogens uh, compared to two hydrogens and another carbon are right here. So we've got uh, this carbon has three H's, this carbon has two H's, and one carbon down here. This carbon has a carbon here, a carbon here, and an H here. So two carbons and one H. So you're not just comparing it to like what the next molecule is, or like what's on the next corner? We're comparing, uh, we're comparing, each, we're comparing this carbon, and this one, and this one. What's it attached to? This is attached to three hydrogens. Where this is attached to two hydrogen and a carbon. This is attached to a hydrogen and two carbons. So it's what's attached to it because these three tied, there are three carbons. Is that cool? Okay. So now I don't know if you can see my numbers anymore, but they're one, two, three, four. What is this? R, if you follow, even if you're doing the paper method, whatever method you're doing, turn to the right, one to two to three. This is going to R. Okay, so connect the dots. Even if you're bad at connecting the dots, you can go like this, zigzag. So go on the right. Okay, so the top one's R. And if you want to do your thumb, the thumb's here, it goes one, two, three with your right hand like this. Or, I don't know if this is down, no, it probably doesn't, I can't see anything. Okay, for the one on the bottom, uh, let's label this one now, I'll do it in blue. This is four, that's easy. Then we've got a, meth, a carbon, a carbon, and a carbon again. Well, what's attached to those carbons, because those three carbons are tiny. This carbon down here has three hydrogens. This carbon has two hydrogens here, and another carbon. And then this carbon has a hydrogen, a carbon, and a carbon. So this one's going to be one, this one's going to be two, and this one's going to be three. It might be me to re-explain that one. It's the same as the top, really. Okay? What do you get on this one? Oh, really? I think I get R. Uh, okay, you, using the thumb method, one, the thumb is out because H is out. One to two to three, it's R. Your right hand does that. If you're uh, using the bus driver, the steering column's in front of you, you're going one to two to three like this. When I turn that around, I'm going right. If you're, uh, what's the other method? 
paper method. Paper method would go like this. You'd redraw it. I'll just draw it smaller though. H, CH3, CH3 over here. This is 1, 2, 3, and 4. Now we've got H in the back. Here you're going left S, so the original must have been R. Okay. Any questions on this? So this is a RR. Uh, if you wanted to name this, it'd be, uh, so this is a cyclobutane, a 1,2-dimethyl cyclobutane. Uh, and it's RR, so you go 1R, 2R. You just put the designation in the front. Position 1 and position 2 are both R's. Okay. 